History of Eswatini, FMR Swaziland Eswatini, formerly known as Swaziland, has a rich and complex history. Here is a detailed overview of the major events and historical periods that shaped the country. Pre-colonial era Around 1750 the De Lamini clan establishes the Swazi kingdom, led by King Nguyen III. 19th century King Swati II successfully expands the kingdom's territory and establishes a central administration. 1843 King Swati II signs a treaty with the British, recognizing the independence of Swaziland. Colonial era 1894 Swaziland becomes a British protectorate following the Anglo-Boer War. Early 20th century British colonial rule is established. With the British South Africa Company administering the region. 1903 The Swazi National Council is created to advise the British administration on Swazi affairs. 1963 Swaziland gains internal self government, with Sobuza II as the first Prime Minister. Independence and post colonial era 1968 Swaziland attains independence from Britain. Remaining within the Commonwealth with King Sobuza II as the country's first monarch. 1973 King Sobuza II suspends the constitution and begins ruling by decree. Establishing a more autocratic system. 2001 King Swati III ascends to the throne following the death of King Sobuza II. 2005 Pro-democracy protests emerge, calling for political reforms and an end to the absolute monarchy. 2018 Swaziland officially changes its name to the Kingdom of Eswatini. A decision made by King Swati III to reflect the country's cultural identity. Recent developments Eswatini faces economic challenges, including high unemployment rates and a large HIV AIDS epidemic. Pro democracy movements continue to advocate for political reforms, including the establishment of a multi party system and more inclusive governance. The government has made efforts to diversify the economy, focusing on sectors such as tourism agriculture, and manufacturing. It's important to note that this is a brief overview, and there are many more details and events that have shaped Eswatini's history. For a more comprehensive understanding, it is recommended to refer to academic sources, historical texts, or visit reputable online resources. Thanks for watching. Please like and share this video. Also hit the subscribe button. Ring the notification bell. And let's embark on a journey of knowledge together.